what's going on youtube welcome to the channel thanks for checking out the channel and if you're new to the channel make sure you hit the like button you hit the subscribe button you hit the notify button where we're always dropping new toyota tacoma content or forerunners so yeah let's just jump into it guys this is literally like i think this is they only got two forerunners on a lot so two forerunners on a lot you guys know i think on the ninth so coming up here soon they are gonna unveil the new 2024 uh toyota forerunner and as what we know so far is probably gonna have the 2.4 turbocharged engine and it's going to share share that engine with uh the tacoma now so the tacoma is now a 2.4 liter uh turbocharged engine which they went from the uh the v6 3.5 my truck right here so so yeah so this is the last naturally aspirated v6 they got a 4.0 engine in here and like i said this is the only this is two on the lot so they got they normally have some over there they normally have them over there but this is the only two that they have on a lot and i'll show you the other one in a second but this is an off-road premium and let's look at the color on this one so yeah this is that classic silver that i really really like and the price of this one is going to be fifty-one thousand, guys 51.3 and here's your options right here you're going to have that power moon roof and you're going to have the kdss so you're going to have the kinetic dynamic suspension system and you're going to have the off-road premium plus package here okay so this is a really nice truck this truck is still made in japan and as far as i know um i'm pretty sure it's still going to be made in japan so that is a good thing so yeah this has the 4.0 engine and the uh, miles per gallon is like a big topic for these ones but i just seen a guy he had 17 16 and 19 so 17 combined 16 in the city and 19. i just seen a really really nice one today this guy had it it looked like it was he probably was getting like 12 miles to the gallon because uh it was all lifted and he had all types of accessories on it and recovery boards and body armor and things like that but yeah so this whole rear window does roll down that is one really really nice option that you get with the forerunner and then you're going to be on 265 70 17. okay and this truck also has a 360 camera which is really really nice let you guys see that up front there super nice and you're going to get a sunroof as well you're going to get integrated uh turn signals there and you're also going to get the blind spot monitor we'll see if this one's open and it's not and with this one you're going to get a heated steering wheel you should get a heated steering wheel with this one so you're going to get the mud flaps Just kind of taking you guys around a little bit so yeah let me dive into a price one more time for you guys 51.3 51.3 oh thanks must have just fell out my car thank you so much yeah, no worries always losing something <laughs> so then we have the pro over here now this has been here for you know for a few days now it's been a couple of people uh taking it out on a test drive so yeah so this is an option here i definitely like this one here this is the pro so let's just look at a price on the pro because these are really similar so 56 56 5 you know show you guys on the inside of these pros are really really nice in here so you're gonna get the leather with the stitched red i like the trd up top here you're gonna get the sunroof you're gonna get heated seats and you're gonna get your little heated steering wheel there it is there's a little button right there nice steering wheel here all your window stuff here your door locks now one thing interesting is about this one so you know with like with my pro you got the uh you got the jbl audio I'm kind of curious to see what kind of. So you get the premium audio eight inch touchscreen. Okay, so you do get the JBL 15 subwoofer. Okay, and the amplifier. Okay, so you do get all that. So let's look at a price again. So I know this is close to fifty-seven thousand dollars. So fifty-seven. Now this one's gonna have a lot of the same things, except it's not gonna have that Fox suspension. 
so yeah 57 and then 53 at uh, 51 so it's a six thousand dollar difference it's a six thousand dollar difference and i would definitely for six thousand dollars i would definitely take i would take the pro because you're gonna get that fox suspension all the way around and i'm pretty sure that fox suspension i don't know if you could um and you got that dynamic kinetic you know suspension on that other one but i don't think you could get fox suspension maybe you could for the five thousand dollars so yeah and the pro is is nice because it's already ready to go and then when you go to resell it so you're going to get the pro resale price compared to if you get the off-road premium and maybe you want to add some stuff but this one's pretty ready to go too i mean you really don't you know you might want to add a lift to this truck just to lift it up a little bit more and then add you some bigger wheels and tires is what i would do on this truck on any of the tacoma trucks is what you want to do so this one already comes lifted a little bit higher and it's going to have the skid plate and uh yeah this is a good looking truck here it's white and i think that's probably the only reason why it's still here a couple people interested in it you know test driving it but for fifty-seven thousand dollars, you definitely want to see if they can come down you know on something like this because this is the last year it's a pro they could try to play games with you and just be like they're going to do msrp but you know money talks so if you come in here ready to buy a vehicle like this you know maybe you could get a discount but white isn't that bad and like like when you got a color like this and if you just really absolutely hate it you can get it wrapped so like that's what everybody's doing these days is wrapping vehicles anyway so like that's always an option so like if there's like if you just get a truck and you just absolutely hate the color just get it wrapped especially if you can't find the color that you want you know and you just got to pull the trigger and you got to go okay like this is the only pro that you're going to get get this color and then wrap it you know wrap it underground if that's the color you choose but yeah this white looks good i, I like the white so it's going to be interesting to see it'll kind of be i think it'll be just like the tacomas you know you're either you know third gen or fourth gen and you know what this is fourth gen and now they're going to be on the fifth gen so yeah a lot of people are buying these trucks left and right i see people buying the pros all the time i see i see people buying these like people are buying the, the 24 tacomas because they are buying them and they're loving them and they're looking good so but you know when you got such a good looking truck like this and one that's been so reliable and people just know that it's going to get you there and get you back you know it's hard to kind of pass up on and this is a good looking truck the more i see it the more i like it and let's look in the back here got a nice little pull down you're definitely going to get a lot more room in these trucks than you do in a tacoma these are really really good looking trucks still made in japan so like i said we got the uh the new forerunner will be unveiled i don't know how i feel about it i don't know how i feel about it i've been looking at it and you know you can't really see can't really see anything right now because it's been all covered up the little pictures and stuff that i've seen but it looks really really big and boxy it almost looks kind of looks like a sequoia almost it looks like a sequoia and it looks kind of weird so i definitely like this one so you know i just kind of got into forerunners you know around the same time i got into tacomas but i really like tacomas more than i like the forerunners but now i really do like them so i definitely like this body style so i don't know we'll see i'll have to just see what the new one looks like that's a nice skid plate down there and i really love the skid plate on these things they look really good on the forerunner so look so here's something interesting so this just must be i don't know what this part is but that's like the same bar that they have on that on the new tacoma so i've been showing you guys this little bar so you can replace that bar right there with a really really fancy looking square one it looks a lot stronger but you don't have you don't have all that stuff hanging down on the tacoma you know there's nothing down there hanging down there that's going to get in the way if you decide to take one of these off-road that hurt pinched myself but yeah so the classic silver that definitely hurt the classic silver or the ice cap so they do what i think toyota should have did i don't know why they didn't i know why they didn't but it still goes up but you can add you can add the power lift tailgate to this so they do that so you can reach out to them or you, it's an aftermarket part but yeah these trucks good looking and that trd pro when you see that you already know what time it is and i definitely like the wheels on this truck a lot better 
than I like the other ones. And this didn't come with any, you know, predator steps. Got that nice hood scoop. How's it going? Good, man. I just sold this one. Oh, you sold it, huh? Yes, Who'd you sell it to? The uh, uh the lady? Was it the la or the first people that test drove it earlier? Yes. Yeah, or not the, or not the guy, not the guy and his dad? Okay, nice. Congratulations, man. So it's sold. There it is, guys. Perfect. It's sold. So <laughs> it wasn't going to last long. So now, yeah, so it's sold just like that. We'll get this guy's name so you guys can talk to him. What's your name so I can tell him to come holler at you? Dustin Davis. Dustin Davis. Holler at Dustin Davis at Capital Toyota, you guys. He got one. He got it sold. So you know he did, he did something right. <laughs> have a good one yeah so there it is guys so now well so much for that so well i guess this is the one you should buy because this is the only one left this is the only one left so see so now so now you only got to pay 51 so 51 000. so we've been seeing these dealerships do several thousand dollars off you know on these forerunners so these guys aren't advertising they're not advertising any discounts, but a closed mouth don't get fed. So you want to reach out to them and ask them. So that one's gone. We'll see. We'll see how long until the next pro shows up. Because like I said, this is the only new one here. But that's going to do it, guys. Have a good day and God bless. So you see, they took the they took the pro. They could have went with this one. They could have saved themselves some money, but they went with the pro. And it was white. So I would have went with the Pro 2, so you already know. So that's going to do it, guys. Have a good day, and God bless. Peace.